Generally, in our communities, if you are seen with a guy that is not your brother, people just assume that the two of you are dating and being Beverly Spanda doesn't make it any easier. These are the guys it has been alleged that she dated. Others she exposed herself while others just remain rumored allegations. At number one, we have Kama Billiard. Back in 2013, Bev and Kama Billiard had a secret relationship. It is reported that Kama Billiard used to pick up Bev after her shows using a friend's car, and this was further cemented by the fact that at one time Bev Akaisa profile picture ya Kama Billiard, aga the ISA status yangi yaga nyora kunzi shamuno wano ni mana uyu takambodanana. But Kama Billiard never confirmed any of these rumors. What further fortifies these allegations is the fact that back in 2020 when Beverly's HIV status was under discussion, Bev commented on Facebook stating that can I ever HIV positive, Kama Billiard wouldn't still be playing soccer until today. At number 2 we have Andy Murizo. Back in 2016, Andy Murizo and Beverly had a secret relationship which later on was exposed by Bev when she went to the H Metro and told the newspaper that she was two months pregnant by Andy Murizo's child. This revelation was made in January 2017 and Andy Murizo did confirm that yes, the two of them had had an affair but things had ended between the two so he couldn't possibly be the father of that child. You are Andy Murizo. Mm. At number three, we have Prophet Walter Magaya. This one is based entirely on allegations, and even Ebev Wajo in a Facebook Live denied ever having anything to do with Prophet Magaya that is romantic. The thing with Bev is she is a subject of interest to a lot of men. So when the prophet converted her into one of his congregants, many people suspected that he had hidden motives towards her. Some of these allegations were fueled by people who were jealous that the prophet had converted Bev and even opened a business for her. It is alleged that at one time Bev was assaulted by Magaya's bodyguard in one church congregant because they were jealous of the close relationship between Bev and the prophet. At number 4 we have Kofi Olomide, yes you heard me right, Kofi Olomide. When Kofi Olomide came to Zimbabwe in 2021, Bev posted pictures of herself and Kofi on her Instagram account and this sparked the controversy. Many people alleged that there was more to the photos than what made the eye, but in an interview with H Metro, Bev confirmed that there was nothing between the two of them. It was just a working relationship which started in 2015 when Bev did a video for Kofi Olomide. At number 5 we have Boss Bola who is a South African based Zimbabwean multi-millionaire businessman. His real name is Agrippa Matambo but he is popularly known as Boss Bola. Allegations that he was dating Beverly Sibanda came out after photos of them were leaked onto the internet. This one is quite funny because number one, Boss Bola was very furious that the photos had been leaked onto the internet. Secondly, it was his girlfriend who showed him the link to the article that alleged that he was dating Bev. It was even reported that Boss Bola had promised to pay Lobola for Bev, but this turned out not to be true as Boss Bola drove all the way from South Africa and came to Harare to do an interview with H Metro and clear his name. At number 6 we have Robert Jr. Allegations that there was something going on between Robert and Bev emerged after photos of them together were uploaded on the internet. Neither Bev or Robert Jr. commented on these rumors so they remain just allegations but given the reputation that Robert Jr. had developed for himself in Saint Tim, people just assumed that there could be something going on between the two of them. At number 7 we have George Jigova. During the time when George Jigova was the goalkeeper for Dynamos, it was reported that he was dating Bev. George vehemently denied these allegations even though other people had reported that he was being seen picking up Bev especially after her shows but he said that it probably was Kama Billiard who was using his car to pick up Bev. At number 8 we have Mufuzi Chambuka. This is one guy Agambo Bigwa Nimun Wesem Zimbabwe because he managed to marry Bev. Back in 2018, Bev had clearly stated that she didn't want to get married to any man. She wanted to be married to her dance career. So when Mufuzi Shambuka married her in 2020, Akaita say hero because he had managed to do something that many people had failed to do. 
Unfortunately, their marriage was short-lived as it ended just a year later amidst cheating allegations on both sides. At number 9, we have the mystery guy who was reported to have married Beth in September 2021. Only photos of this guy emerged at what looked like a family gathering in which many people just thought that Beth was getting married. This guy is said to be a healer's assistant to Sekuru Wungwe. Other people insinuated that this was a plot by Beth to make her ex-husband Mufuzi Chambuka jealous so that he would think that she had already moved on and gotten married. With that, we come to the end of the video. Let me just conclude by saying that with Bev, if any man is seen with her, it is just alleged that the two of them are dating. But well, sometimes it is not true. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment.